The sun casts a long shadow. Let us not keep Terwish waiting. I cannot bear another lecture. These contracts. It is quite a few Darwish has pushed your way now. He knows I will come through. You have his trust. That much is clear. Do you suppose you have theirs? These shadowy types? I should hope so by now. Then they should show it. You take all the risk and they offer little in return. They are liberators, Nihal, not merchants. I know the stories. Still, the price of liberty should be enough to feed us. About this contract, I do not want you to mistake my words for pestering. I am only looking out for you, Yasadiki. It is no inconvenience to stand up to our oppressors as the Hidden Ones do. Do you think yourself some hero of tomorrow? The next Gilgamesh? No. I am merely the son of a public servant who dedicated his life to the betterment of his people. Only to be slighted and forgotten. But, I am honored you think I could reach such heights. I may just aim for them. That is not at all what I said. It is what I heard. Such crowds. Something important must be happening. The Khalifa has been summoned to the Winter Palace. It is surely his wealthy retinue that drives this crowd. Ah. Perhaps they're in the mood to offer donations. Ah, I see your meaning. A little sleight of hand to sharpen our wits. If this contract will not feed us, the Hilafa might as well. That merchant has left his purse on the table. An easy one to begin with. Better leave before they notice. Come here! Ready yourself. I will pick them out. A keen eye and an agile hand. A formidable duo. Hmm. There. The boisterous one. He must have something of value. Where are you going now? Sneaky, sneaky. And over there, by that stall, she's got some coin. Well done. You truly are the master thief of Anbar. Is that jealousy I hear? Hardly, O oh great looter of purses. Insufferable. Come, we are late to Durwishes. Oh. 
Well met. They're all looking spry. Peace, friend. I wonder what tales we will hear. Why, 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 why? Here is the lazy boy. I have been waiting on you. Someone has to plan our meals. <laughs> Hold. Food. I would not flaunt that around the markets. <laughs> Trust me. Go to Zahida's. <laughs> she uses lots of butter. That she does. You look weary. Are you well? It is nothing a little adventure will not fix. What do they need? A shipping ledger at the harbor. It is worth nothing by itself, but the information it contains is valuable to them. This is... Never mind your ego. The Khalifa's guards are here in number. And you worry for me more now than when we lived in Baghdad. My worry is the same. I've only grown too old and too tired to hide it. Bring the ledger back here. We have not talked about my fee. And we won't. Not until the deed is done. Shocking. He is just a messenger. And you are still an errand boy. You can do this one... I saw them with all the soldiers. Parading into the Winter Palace. Did they have swords and spears? Of course. They are soldiers. I'd like to steal a sword or a helmet. What was the final tally of what we received? Sixteen crates. One chest, half a dozen satchels. Only three crates remain, last time I checked the ledger. Give their handlers until tomorrow evening. If they don't show by then, we must assume they've forgotten about their wares. Open them up. Keep whatever catches our eyes. Dump the rest. Wait here. If I am seen, I will have to flee. Good thing I can outrun these sagging guards. Locked. A minor delay.
I wonder what secrets this ledger holds. Maybe I can get the old Grouser Derwish to squeeze a hint out of our contact. Still in one piece, I see. It was all too easy. Uh, huh? We could use some eyes around the city. I'll see what I can do. She looks important. You should haggle for a better fee. Shh. Oh, Basim, what timing? Did you get it? Without a fuss. Give it here. You are one of them. There. It looks as though it was delivered this morning. You're certain it is the chest you seek? I am certain. Pale boy. You need something stolen? I am your man. Your wish can attest. He has given me all your contracts. Then you have done your part. I can do more. Two of my best men died on this pursuit. I doubt a street thief would fare much better. Then let me join you. You have two openings. We should take half this thief without insult. Ah. Thank you, Derwish. Listen here, Basim. You want to keep working for me? You keep your head down and your mouth shut. <laughs> Why must you embarrass yourself like that? Like what? Like a beggar. Desperate for them to notice you. Desperate? Nihal, I am good at what I do. That woman would be lucky to have me. But she does not want you. You are a street thief with dirty feet. So why bother? Why keep pushing yourself down this path? Because being a street thief is not the peak of my ambition. I have more to offer this world than my nimble fingers. They just cannot see it yet. Almost, Jessup. <laughs> what is this? Aha! Uh -huh. This is my latest creation. It helps me fend off angry merchants when they... Uh, catch me digging around their wares. I will consider myself spared. You smell foul. What is that? Ta! <coughs> we have been fishing at the harbor since morning. Terrible luck, though. The harbor? Did you happen to see or hear any fuss over a chest? Hmm. Ah, yes. A black one. Very beautiful. Some burly guards took it with them to... Shukran laka, ya jasib. <laughs> what are you doing?
They want that chest, and I am going to get it for them. Then they will see. There is just no getting through to you, is there? Then we will do this together. If you get caught at the Winter Palace, they will kill you on sight. We will need a safe way in. And I know where we might scout one. That is if you can bear to follow my lead for a change. You do not have to get involved, Nihal. I know your feelings on this. It is utterly foolish. But it seems I cannot, so I will come with and nag you until you decide to abandon the idea of stealing a chest from the Khalifa's winter... When you say it like that, it only excites me further. Are we going or not? Lead the way. This is a mad plan, Basim. Even if you were to succeed and they welcome you into their ranks, what then? Will you forget about us? Of course not. Nihal, their interests are our interests. You, me, and every other street dweller who has been cast aside. Living off scraps and dirty water. I can be an instrument that sees us out of that life. That sees that Jasip can use his talents to be a real craftsman. That sees that good men are not cast aside as my father was. And no children left wondering what tomorrow will bring. I hear what you are saying, Basim. But you paint a portrait of a world that cannot exist. That is where we disagree. There it is, the Winter Palace. Come, this way. Right behind you.